Welcome to All Saints Catholic School e-learning. The big idea we'll be looking at today is conditional statements when programming in Python. By the end of this video, you will have an understanding of the basics of programming, including what conditional statements are and how we can use them in Python and in other areas of the Computer Science GCSE syllabus. So when we are coding in Python, it's sometimes necessary to execute tasks within the program but only if certain criteria are met. We solve this through the use of conditional statements. A conditional statement is an expression that is either true or false. Conditions are often created by comparing values using conditional operators. You can see some examples of conditional statements on the screen. Conditional statements are used in many programming languages and enable more effective problem solving. The if statement is a very common example of a conditional statement. The logic of the statement works in that an action will only be executed if the statement condition is achieved. Consider the example on the screen. We are asking the user to select an answer to a simple question, choosing what the capital of England is. An input variable is defined called answer. And you can see that after naming the variable, we create an input statement using the correct brackets and speech marks. It's also worth noting that the different colours of the coding represents different commands and sections of the programming language used by Python. We then start writing the if statement, taking care not to start if with a capital letter. A colon at the end of the condition suggests an action may follow. Notice the indentation on the line after the statement. This makes it clear to the program that what is happening is part of the conditional statement. We then save and run the code, choosing a suitable name to save the program and putting py afterwards to signify a Python file. You will notice that on first running of the code, an error message appears which is quickly corrected. The program is run again with complete success. Great work! You now have a secure understanding of what we mean by conditional statements in Python and how we can code using conditional statements.